happy holidays and such. We hope that they're filled with love and stuff. And we hope that you get kissed under the mistletoe. That's a weird thing, kissing under the mistletoe. Yeah. For centuries, the Greeks used it for their healing properties. They used it for period cramps and spleen disorders, and Pliny the Elder, a Roman naturalist, said that it could be used as a balm against epilepsy, ulcers, and poisons. The romantic overtones that the mistletoe has been rumored to have began with the ancient Celts in 1st century CE. The mistletoe would bloom in even the frozen winters, and the Druids began to revere it as a sacred symbol of vivacity, and they would use it on humans and animals to bestow fertility. The most known story of mistletoe, about the mistletoe, comes from North mythology. The story goes, Balder, Odin's son, was prophesied to die. His mother, Frigg, the goddess of love, took an oath from fire and water, iron and all metals, stones and earth, from trees, sickness and poisons, and from all four-footed beasts, birds, and creeping things, that they would not hurt Balder. Of course, everyone had heard of what Frigg had done. So at a large gathering shortly following, they, would all, they had all taken part in throwing rocks and shooting arrows and trying to even set Balder off on fire. And he came out unscathed every time. Loki was jealous of Balder's invincibility. And he was, then he sent out to find the only thing on earth that could harm Balder. Frigg had forgot to ask the mistletoe, tiny and forgotten, that it would not hurt Balder. Loki fashioned a dagger about of it, out of it, and murdered Balder in front of all the gods that loved him so dearly. Frigg was devastated. The son whom she had worked so very hard to protect was murdered right in front of her. It is said that her tears became the berries of the plant, and that any time... Anyone. And it was decreed that mistletoe would no longer harm anyone, and anyone who passed under it would receive a kiss from Frigg. So, I think it's safe to say that the reason we kiss people under the mistletoe is because Loki's a little shit. Pretty much. No wonder Nick Fury was so pissed off. Yeah. I think that's the moral of every Norse story. <laughs> Loki is a little fucking shit. Basically. Yeah. In the description box below, we have provided you links to pages and things where you can reach us with your questions, concerns, and requests. Also in our description box below, we have included a link to our Christmas video, which you should totally check out. And until then, we hope that your holidays are filled with love and things and fun and stop avoiding your family and watching YouTube videos and go hang out with them because that's what the holidays are about. And yeah. we'll see you next time when you're avoiding your family again because you don't and like to listen. Yeah. So, bye! bye.